Can't get enough of too much love Big hugs and kisses And laying on the lounge is good I found For letting go of the business We just feel Lean up on the good things We just feel lean up on the good things. Okay, well here we go. I've got a hold of the Oztrack Simpson X trailer. This has been a bit of a dream and a bucket list item for me to try out for a little while. And I'm super keen to check out whether this might be the trailer that I want for me, my family, my mates to do all the adventures that I want to do. So right now, I'm on Morton Island. This is a shakedown. And these are the top 10 reasons just to get you started for why I want this trailer. Morton! Woo! 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 Escape the fake. <laughs> Escape the fake. Escape, Escape the fake. The fake. <laughs> Firstly, this trailer is set up as a home base. What that means is me, my mates, my family, we can drive in here, drop it off, set the tent up, set the awning up, and actually go and have our adventures. This is the one thing I've been missing while I've been rooftop tenting because I have to fold that rooftop tent up every time I want to go somewhere. So now that rooftop tent is up there and I can take off and do something else. Number two, what that means because all of that camping gear is set up here, I've got all the room over in my vehicle to put surfboards up in the roof, more luggage in the back and that's something I'm really looking forward to instead of skimping on my adventure gear. Number three, when I am on long distance travel, going place to place, maybe doing four, five, six hours a day, getting up to the Northern Territory, whatever it may be, it's super easy to pull up on the side of the road, still on the back of the vehicle, fold out the awning if the weather needs it, need a bit of shade, whatever it is, but if I don't need to, just leave it folded up, pull the tent out, pull the kitchen out, pull the fridge out, and cook, eat, sleep, get up the next morning and do it all again. So it's super versatile for those long trips as well. Number four, for me at home, this is easy to store. But if I take the rooftop tent off, I can store it right up in the back corner of my garage, no problems at all. It is not long, it is not big, it doesn't take up a lot of space. So that is a big plus for me. Number six, I can tow this absolutely anywhere. The suspension set up, the long draw bar, short turning circle because it's a short trailer. It's fully set up to go absolutely anywhere. Not only that, it's light. So it's low on fuel, low on cost and easy to get around. Number seven, I love this brand. I've been exploring right across all the brands. I've tried a couple of trailers. I love what they're doing with their product. I love all the range that they're doing all the way through. They've really caught my eye. Oztrack are doing some really, really cool things. And after all, Oztrack, that's what I'm all about, going exploring the Oztrack. So when I saw Simpson, Tanami, all the different models, I started to see one model would fit each different family but you could see the quality that was put into each one. So I'm loving what they're doing. Number eight, back to Oztrack, I love their vision. I love what they're about. The videos they're putting on, uh, the sustainability videos, their vision is actually to get more people back out in nature and that's what I'm about. So clearly, that's a good fit. I'm thinking that's what I wanna do. I wanna get me back out in nature, my family, my friends, but encourage more people to get back out in nature. So number nine, how do they do this? The affordability. For me to get into a trailer, mm, I've got other commitments in life. Do I want to pay 50, 60, 70, 80 thousand dollars for a trailer? No, I don't. This trailer is under 20 thousand dollars. The 2019 Camper Trailer of the Year. At that stage, it was 17,990. There's a few more things in there now. We've got lithium batteries, um, other things going on. This is now 19,990, and what you get in this package is absolutely unbelievable. I think that's affordable for almost anyone with a decent job and a little bit of spare change around to pay it off or do whatever, but get out in nature affordably. It's unbelievable. Number 10, the final one. Look, this is an incredible package, but if you wanted to, you could change the awning system around or you could change the rooftop tent. We well, could maybe change the pump or upgrade the batteries or do a couple of other things to it if you wanted to. Here's the thing though, and this is a bit of a spoiler alert, is everything we've used here right now, I wouldn't change. It's incredible. 
trying to impress me, pulling out all the stops. Making my dizzy when you tell me what you want. I just wanted you to see me. Never thought you'd notice. Thought that you should know I'm already sold. So never let me go. You had me at a Features. A McHitch tow system that you can tow absolutely anywhere with a really simple lock mechanism. Drawbar and chassis built tough, built to last, as they say at Austrack. Stone guards, spare wheel, and lock away storage up front. Massive storage all around with easily accessible compartments. My favourite, the bonus storage cage on top. An 1800 wide rooftop tent fold out with full annex underneath and incredible views, waterproof fly on top. That is so comfortable. There's room for three people up there or two people in all your bags. 270 wraparound awning with walls and an ensuite in the front corner. Speaking of ensuite, there's a shower, hot water system and a portable toilet. Fully plumbed gas system with nine kilo gas bottle holder and two outlet. The hot water system and shower is on a tripod. It's absolutely amazing. It will have you in a hot water shower in about 10 to 15 seconds from when you start running that water. 100 litres fully plumb system with four outlets, plus room for two jerry cans, 20 litres, fuel or water, or a bit of both. Electrical system running off a 100 amp hour lithium battery, powered by a 200 watt solar panel, full battery management system, switches and reset switches, and all the plugs you need for power out and lightning fast power in. There's a light system for tent, awning, kitchen and cupboards, and the whole trailer is lockable. Off-road suspension setup, a twin burner Dometic stove, a cutlery drawer and preparation bench and on the other side a beautiful little stainless steel sink with drainage fully plumbed. There's rated snatch recovery points and bike rack holder at the back. The package also includes a 70 litre dual zone fridge freezer from Arctic with plenty of room on the fridge slide for storage at front and back. You're up on 265-75 R16 mud tyres. These are really good tyres. Bonus Bluetooth stereo with twin speakers if you want to rock the camp or relax to some Mozart. Beautiful finish, decals and attention to detail that belies the price tag of this trailer. It's unbelievable that it's under 20K and you get all those elements. Everything is in the pack ready to go, right down to your guy ropes and your pegs. You're ready to drive away. Okay, well Marillo, that's your first look, our little wave that we've told you about.
here in paradise and this is exactly why I'm looking at this trailer. So I can now put this trailer in the camp down the road but I can take that four wheel drive anywhere around the island and not have to pack up everything each time I leave camp. Bloody beautiful. something new we've brought away the Simpson X yeah and which has left us with the car to just fill with junk like it's absolutely full of boards foils fishing rods everything because we can fit it all in the trailer the home base is back there ready to go and charging up right now absolute game changer where you can just drive away first thing in the morning it can be 5 30 in the morning you can just go and get in your car and go go for a surf mm -hmm. every time we've gone back to this trailer <laughs> yes. it's sitting above 13 volts and we haven't been too concerned about we haven't been back there we haven't turned the we didn't solar panel to follow the sun anything not once yesterday we left at 6 30 we got back at six o'clock <laughs> we're out literally 12 hours yesterday and didn't think about the thing once and we yeah. got back to check it and it was like still running 13 volts the fridge is cold ice is cold everything's just cold uh, and we got go. back in the dark we walked in flicked, flicked the, lights the lights on, on yeah started cooking straight away yeah. everything was there that that's new to me that's yeah. not that's that's new you yeah. know to have that just basically all ready to go like that and also the fact that it's all packed into that tiny little thing when we started unpacking it mm. we're pulling things out of everywhere and we had what, what, three whole compartments that we didn't use at all. Yeah, Put nothing was, in yet. Yeah. This, I love this Pajero Sport I'm in. And with everything on it, all the different things I've done to it and getting a good price to start, I probably spent $55,000 on it. Yeah. You can spend 50% more than that on a camper trailer. Yeah, I know. So yeah, I'm know. towing this and putting that on that Simpson X on the back for less those two things together for less than the price of some camper trailers that are out there. Cheers. Uh, man, I think it's very compact. It's like so nice to see when everything's inside. Like it's so small. Uh, you can carry like everywhere. Like you don't have the trouble like on the on the tracks. You know, like sometimes you have a big caravan and like you have trees and have oh I have to turn around and you cannot turn. All this kind of stuff. And then when you open up, you have like shower. You have like oven, you have like 
everything that you need to have in a camp, especially if you're in a group of people. So it's so cool to have it. Really well built. It looks like amazing construction. I like how all the compartments kind of work. There's plenty of room for storage. The kitchen's amazing. As you can see, I'm using it right now for my coffee. Um, I think it's a really good setup, Trev. It's been a good little morning and evening little like cook-up kind of area. It's been nice. It's been nice to gather around, for sure. And I think it's been uh, the simplicity. So, you know, whenever we needed something to do around food, around the campsite, whether it's um, preparing a meal or whatever, we'll all turn back to this little hub here. And this little hub, like, I was surprised when I first saw it how small it was. And then we were sitting around the camp and I was like, hey, Trev, you got one of these? Yeah, mate, got one of them. Pulls out a drawer. Guess what's in there? Everything we need, you know? So it's been super convenient and it l l literally simplified the whole camping experience actually it's been been epic um you guys have ticked all the boxes that's for sure so this is really impressive eh? so practical and compact and yeah it's awesome So, when camping really tests you, so far so good. So far so good mate, we're dry. We've dropped it down, that's how much water is falling consistently. That's not lifting the roof, that's just consistently dropping like that. And then, there we go, Dan is out there with the fire, with the spaghetti, trying to put the lid back on the uh, camp cooker, camp oven, and we're under here. Did the standard drop down the guy ropes and that's let all any water come off, that was fine. Also tent is bone dry, uh, making sure these are really tight. Stopped any pooling up on the top here as well. And this rain was calming down. Yeah, it's pretty epic. It's pretty small, compact. Um, everything that you need in a trailer um, is there. It's got your gas bottle, your water, um, everything nice and light, towed well on the hard, um, the high tide coming back in then, so it was pretty cool. I was blown away, firstly just at 20 grand, like if you were to be like, I'm going to make my perfect four wheel drive, you would have to spend way more than 20 grand to get what everything is in here. Very well thought out, however, you know, some engineer obviously spent a lot of time, how do we maximise it? But couldn't believe it when the rooftop was out, awning was out, the storage, the how like easy the fridge was to get into. So pretty much every detail. And as I said, for 20 grand, um, how easy it towed. So I think absolute winner. Like I know my missus, I sh we showed her when we were sitting up and she was kind of like, oh, that looks nice. Got to say, easy to pack up, easy to set up. We uh, were on a bit of a schedule, get across the island, high tide, did it easy. Here we are, 10 minutes to spare, cooked up bacon and egg wrap great trip that are literally more off the beaten track uh, this will allow you to do it because it's um it is compact it's got um it's great entry and exit angles uh which is going to make towing with whatever you're towing it with relatively easy i would say well there you go just about done waiting for the ferry what a week epic crew epic place epic setup i think i'm just about sold I think this is my new life. Can't get enough of too much love, big hugs and kisses. And laying on the lounge is good, I found for letting go of the business. We just feel lean up on the good things.